Hey guys, what's up? My name is Prez and welcome to another episode of NHL Be A Pro, episode 60. I hope you guys enjoy this one. Today we're going to take a look at our stats, our points, our our place in the leaderboard uh, basically for our division and uh, we are second. So we need to start winning a little bit more games to actually get into first, which it doesn't matter if we stay in second, third, around there. We're, we're pretty good for the playoffs, and I think we actually could win the playoffs. Um, right now, Sidney Crosby is leading our team with 55 points, and I'm pretty sure I'm right behind him with, yeah, 52 points. Me and him in this season are killing it. So is Phil Kessel. So the top three players is um, Phil Kessel, um, Sidney Crosby, and me. I'm a franchise high player. Crosby is the exact franchise and Kessel is elite. So me and Crosby are both franchise players, but today we're going to face off against the Minnesota Wilds. I hope you guys enjoy it. We only have a couple of months left. We only have January, February, March, April. We only have one, two, three, four, five, around four more months of just hockey. Now I'm going to show you guys every single game. Now I did this from the beginning. I showed you guys every single game. So we're about 60 games into an 82 game season and that's not including the playoffs. So I hope you guys enjoy this episode and uh, let's see if we can actually make a playoff run. We got to stop losing. We got to win more. But anyways, my name is Prez and I'll see you guys when we get on the ice. This is a weird ass intro, but I'll see you guys when we get on the ice. All right, guys, so we're on the ice with Crosby and Kessel, of course. The top three players in the Pittsburgh Penguins is on the same line um, with the most points. And I'm pretty sure I'm pretty much going to lead the league in the most amount of faceoffs won. I'm probably going to get um, either... I'm hoping to actually get an award for, like, the rookie of the year or something like that. Cause this, this is my rookie year. This is my very first year on Pittsburgh Penguins. And I believe I only got, like, a one-year contract with them. So, I think... Um, I don't know what team I think I'm going to go to next. Um, I really like, um, I really want to play on Chicago, not Chicago, I really want to play on Washington because another favorite player of mine uh, is uh, Ovechkin and I'd rather play with Ovechkin than Patrick Kane and all that because I don't like Patrick Kane and um, I, just, I just don't like him. I know he's a really good hockey player. I don't doubt him on that. I don't doubt him on that to be you know, like a really good hockey player. I just, I don't like him. Like, as a person, and I can't really explain how I don't really like him, um, because, I don't know, it's, it's not that, I'm not that type of person to, like, I know he's a really good hockey player, I know that, and he, I don't disarm him for that, being a really good hockey player, it's, I don't think he's, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not gonna go into further details, because, uh, I think some of you are actually uh, some Patrick Kane fans or Chicago fans, and uh, I like I like Jonathan Taves. I like Jonathan Taves. He's a really good hockey player. I love him. He's a really good hockey player and um, a really good person overall. He's one of the best captains in the NHL right now. And um, yeah, so. But anyways, I would like to play for Washington, and uh, I would love to play for the Ducks. If I could play for the Ducks, I'll definitely stay on the Ducks for the rest of my NHL. Be a be a pro like career. Until NHL 17 comes out, then um, we'll see what happens then. Um, maybe maybe that time I'll actually include like the full season of the CHL or the OHL. Oh, it's part of the OHL. But the CHL is pretty much the same thing. It's all the same league. But um, yeah, so maybe I'll show the whole season. Because uh, last last time when I was playing, when I was playing this and I was doing the OHL, I wasn't really showing you guys like every single game. I was just going to show you guys like every other game, like two or three games a month. Then I skip ahead to the next month and all that stuff. And um, I believe our team didn't really make it to. Minnesota's fans. No, we didn't win any championship. I don't think. And um, so I think we made it to the playoffs, but we lost in the playoffs. And um, but that's uh, just heartbreaking. But it happens. It's hockey. But hopefully, hopefully we can make it to the playoffs this year, and hopefully we can actually, I can actually win the Stanley Cup, and I would love to win the Stanley Cup the first year, my my rookie year. That would be amazing. That would give me so um, much prospect for a different team if I want to, if I want to go to a different team. That that would definitely be on my resume on this team, like on this on this game. So 
it's a good it's a good thing to have, especially when I'm I'm considered a franchise player. Uh, that's really really big to be a franchise player. And um, I really need to clean up my game, guys. I really need to clean up my game. Um, I think for the very last game, the very last game of the season, I'm gonna play like a full game. I'm gonna play the full 20 minute game for you guys. Um, I wanted to do that for quite a while. I wanted to do that for my 100th episode, but I don't think I'm gonna do it for my 82 episode. I think I believe it's like 83 episodes actually, because the very first episode wasn't really a game. So, so really, we're only at 59 games. But uh, anyways, I haven't skipped any games yet, guys. I haven't skipped any games. So you guys are seeing the whole NHL season of my NHL Be a Pro. And I believe some people said, like people said in the comments, some people said earlier in the comments, like, oh, you can skip some games and blah, blah, blah. I don't want to skip any games. I did that for NHL 15. And I made it to the year 2026. And uh, I don't want to do that. I really want to make it to, like, like, see, like, 2018 or like something a little bit shorter than 2026 it's pretty ridiculous that uh, I made it to 2026 in that in that in that game so but anyways we haven't really gotten any points we really haven't any, got any goals or anything like that and um, we need we need to get some points underneath our belt here guys we need, definitely need to get some points so what I was thinking, um, by the way, the video the video is gonna be a little bit different today. Um, it's gonna be audio like uh, I don't usually do this to my videos because uh, I just like pumping them out, just making them. I really don't focus on like the coloring and the color accuracy and um, the coloring is pretty good when it comes down to it um, at the end of it. But the audio I was trying to make a little bit better and hopefully the audio is a lot better. It's gonna be a lot cleaner audio and um so it's gonna be a lot cleaner audio because i saved a preset i did i did a, like a whole bunch of tests and all that stuff so i made this preset just for my audio like just for my voice and the way i commentate it makes it a lot better guys it makes it a lot cleaner and uh so you guys can hear me a lot better and the microphone is actually below me like i did before the first time and I like it down here. I like it better down here because it's a lot better. I can, I can like move around a lot better. I don't have to stay in front of the mic and like, I can see the whole screen and everything. I don't want to have it on like a microphone stand or a desktop stand. But you guys can hear if I bang like that. It's not really a good shock mount. And I actually plan on buying like a really good shock mount for this mic and boom arm that attaches to my desk. That attaches to my desk and you guys might have seen it like other youtubers videos it's basically it's basically like a microphone stand that attaches to your desk and like it's it's more like you like you see in like a radio radio station it's mostly what you see in a radio station like that type of setup so um it's gonna be like that type of setup for mine and um oh fuck oh slap shot blocked oh come on Wanna be into a game hit or be hit? Oh, there we go, an assist. There we go. We got a point. I don't care how we get the points, either assist or non-assist or goals or anything like that. I just want to get a point like each game. Um so Crosby got a point, I got a point. Um so So we're doing we're doing pretty good, me and Crosby. Um we're on the same line, so we're doing pretty good as like a team together. And um, I assisted on him. I assisted to him like a lot of goals during the season, and he assisted a lot of my goals. And we assisted a lot of like Phil Kessel's goals, and I assisted his goals and like all that stuff. So we're working good as a team, like as a passing team. Like we know where we're going to be. I know where Crosby and Phil Kessel is going to be all the time. Crosby's usually on the the left side, and then Phil Kessel's on the right side. Of each like of the net, so it's it's a lot better. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get the empty net here. Nope, I'm gonna hit the post. Come on, I have to get the empty net. Nice fake, shake some loose. And he'll cover. God damn it, I'm gonna be on the bench for the last 14 seconds. 
Oh, fuck. Sorry, guys. Um, sorry for this very short episode, but I really had to get this episode done and edited and all that stuff for you guys. I promise next episode will be a little bit longer. I will include the second period next episode. I'm going to start doing that again. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't. If you guys like NHL and you guys like watching NHL videos, make sure you guys hit that like button and that subscribe button. And, uh... Uh, what is your I want to ask you guys a question what is your favorite player in the NHL currently like what is your favorite player right now currently tell me in the comments below I'm very interested to know but anyways my name is Prez and I'll see you guys tomorrow with a new episode peace out